welcome back to a month of happiness with Miss Molly's Kitchen. Now, I have to say a thank you to Feed the Hungry, my, my newest sponsor, and thank you to Barnes & Noble, our 600 stores, as well as Europe and the United Kingdom. And today, today's my birthday week, and this is what we're gonna talk about Feed the Hungry. These are the needs. So first of all, Faith at Works leases a building that allows Feed the Hungry to go in with their volunteers and help people with whatever the needs are, okay? From A to Z. Now, the actual building that we are working on, that we have, we need 650,000 for the actual building itself. That's what it's gonna take as far as manpower and whatever else is needed. Now, we also are building a thrift store that'll be 300,000 and the Boys and Girls Club is, is gonna be at least 600,000. So all donations, remember, this is nonprofit, are all tax deductible. Small or large are all welcomed. So thank you for tuning in and I have a special treat for you, so come back. Feed the Hungry Corporation feeds anyone hungry in the area and when possible identifies and helps with deeper needs. We provide groceries, clothing, counseling, gift cards, pay utility bills, and even provide hope for individuals and families in need. The growth in the number of people in need requires our expansion, which is driving our need for land and a larger warehouse for storage and distribution. Please go to our website at fthcorp.org and donate what you can or volunteer if you like. We need your help. Thank you. Welcome back. Now, today, what we're going to be cooking out of my book is day 23. And I have a special guest here today along with a, a, a guest who's been on the show for a bit, our mixologist from Las Vegas, Double D. Now, I am going to start cooking Day 23, Sunset Dip. I'm going to introduce my guest here, Shara Saunders. Hello, everyone, and special thanks to Miss Molly for having me on today. So I wanted to talk a little bit about a quilt cool page that I recently started on Instagram, and I made this page to inspire myself and others if we're ever having any, any self-doubt, to uplift, and just to bring a pleasant experience when looking through photography since it's also one of my passions. I also brought a few photos to show of some of the pictures I have on the page now. And with the quotes, this photo is by Chris1016 and a quote from Motivational Boba. Perfection is not attainable, but if we chase perfection, we can catch excellence. This one is by Carrie Delgard. The quote for this is, love deeper than any place pain has reached. Ooh, I like that one. This photo my brother actually took in New York. The quote I have on the page for it is by Osho International from one of the books that I read, One Man Becoming Blissful Can Trigger a Process in Thousands of People. And that's a great thing to remember because we can all inspire everyone. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. So this one, this photo is by Warren P. Lan, a quote by Ram Doss. When you know how to listen, everyone is the guru. One of my favorite away photos. <laughs> and this one is a photo by Preludio Official, a quote by Rosebeth Moss Cantor. A vision is not just a picture of what we could be, it's an appeal to our better selves, a call to become something more. This next one is a photo by Pablo Sue. Ooh. Always help someone. You might be the only person who does. This reminds me of a party. This looks like stars or something. Something. What is that? Lights? Yeah, what tons of string lights hung up Ooh, down the whole walkway. I love that. It's nice. my favorite. A little bit of the top got cut off of this from the quilt, but I took this photo of a flower in a park in Henderson. The quotes by Zig Ziglar, you can change what you are and where you are by changing what goes into your mind. Mm -hmm. Just a nice reminder to always bring the best and the brightest. You know, he's a great man. I met him. You did? I did. Oh my goodness. He's in, well, he's, he's at Jack Graham's church mm -hmm. 
he actually is an amazing guy and they do actually seminars at Jack Graham's church. Wow, He's a Baptist. I know. Oh Lifeline. Spiritual it. connections. I love it. Right. And then the last one, um, photo by Pablo Sue again and post by the good quote. Um, I wish you success. I wish you knowledge. I wish you wealth. I wish you love. I wish you peace in any order. <laughs> I love it. Yes. And you know what my quote today was? Yes. Do something that you've never done before. That was a great one. So what's going on, Devil Dean? What did you make? Nothing much. Well, she was showing all this beautiful art, so I decided to make some of my own. Cool. That will be unique and fantastic and very easy to enjoy. Ooh. Want to take a God, photo? That's gorgeous. In honor of your, uh, of your, your meal that you're making today or yes. your dish. Yes. The, uh, the sunset dip. I yeah. decided to do a little play on that and make a spin off of tequila sunrise. So we have the blackout sunrise right there. Now, anyone who's had enough tequila has obviously blacked out before. So it's, I think it's uh, it's very pertinent and we all have a shared experience with that. So it's something we can all relate to. It's beautiful. Well, in honor of your birthday week, I yes. did a little something extra on there for you. So I'll light things up for you. Oh, happy birthday. Thank <laughs> you. Oh, that's gorgeous. That is a, a beautiful on there. cocktail. Look at that. Okay, I'm going to finish my dip while you're doing, while we're singing or doing whatever you want to do. We'll let, the, we'll let everybody sing at home because I'm going to spare them the torture that would be. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm listening while y'all cook. I'll listen. Okay. <laughs> we should start sparking any second, but go ahead and blow those out and you can make two wishes. One for each of your sponsors. All right. That's a good idea. All right. Please, Lord. Bless Feed the Hungry and bless Barnes and Noble because everyone needs help. <laughs> Yay! And guys, so, again, any amount that you want to donate helps out. Again, they're looking for 650000 to build a facility, 300000 to make that, uh, to make the... That's the thrift store. The thrift store. I'm sorry. Yeah. And then the other 600000 for the Boys and Girls Club. And those are all so great for everybody. They bring the community together and they really allow people to get back up on their feet that need a little bit of help. Yes. And Double D, listen, the Faith at Works Ministry actually has volunteers for Feed the Hungry now. Oh, wow. So if anybody calls, whether they're here in Nevada or California, Arizona, anywhere, they, they will pay your bills on, their, on your behalf. Right. So if it's if I need help with the light bill, they will pay the light company my bill. So we also give counseling to those that need it. But yes, double D, we there's a need. Everybody needs help. It's not just feeding our mouths. It's it's about what is what is the underlying problem? You know, not only of this pandemic that we've been going through, but it's kind of like at the end of the day, what we give will come back to us down the road. And Absolutely. Yeah, so I mean like doing these, this is a gorgeous cocktail. Okay, so you guys, I have to tell you about, the sunset dip is, this is easy. So I'm gonna show you the beautiful, the beautiful finished touch, and we're gonna take a picture, I'm gonna put it on here. But everything I use is organic, yes? And right here, this is your cream cheese with minced garlic and this is virgin olive oil, okay? So, I'm gonna put this down, I'm gonna show you the actual finishing touches, but I'm gonna have Double D, because he saw the, the one that was done, I'm gonna have him finish up with, you see how I made the other one earlier, right? So all you do is take the cheese here, put it around here, and what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put this over here. So, you just kinda make it look like a sun, right? So I'm gonna push this out a little bit because we'll have to put this in the microwave for like 30 seconds, okay? And this is so good because it's all really good for you. So we're building a little lake in the center of it that we can let the salsa in, then we're gonna put the cheese on the outside. Yeah. All right, perfect. I think the only reason you have me here every week is so I can do the, heart, the heavy lifting for you. I'm starting to notice that. I know. <laughs> Okay. You mentioned it was all organic, which is great. Yes, and, and the chips. Okay, mm -hmm. let me get back over there. So, the chips, ladies and gentlemen, these are, they're actually a veggie chip. And this would be like a tomato here, right? And then this will be your, this will be corn, and there's potato, and then the green 
for the actual greens. So while Double D is gonna finish up, what we're gonna do is, Double D, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna put it in the microwave first. Okay, right? and then we'll add the salsa afterward? Yeah. All right. And then, hang on a second. And so, then we can start drinking. Yeah. Hey, would you make another cocktail? Absolutely, I'd love to. Because this is, I just wanna give our guest, Shara, this cocktail, this is my birthday, and technically not till Friday, but that's for you, okay? Oh, thank you so much. Okay. All right, very special gift. All right, so. Wow, it's delicious. Glad you like it. It really tastes like blackberry. Move this out of the way. Okay. Very yeah. refreshing. Yeah. Now, is there any? Let me ask you, Shara. Is there anything else that you wanted to tell us about your blog? Are you gonna, ladies and gentlemen? I want you to know that she is an unbelievable blogger because we met in a food place. We did. We yes, met we did. At the bakery, I'm employed with Cineholic. We pretty much have all plant-based items, cinnamon rolls. You can build your own, you can choose from our specialty roll items. We have tons of catering options, other snacks, banana bread that our owner created. It's so amazing. It is amazing. Yeah, I actually do have three photos of that as well. Ooh, let's and, see. Oh, there These are vegan, happen. ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yes. And they are so good. Mm -hmm. Yes, and from my blog, quote page, if you wanna Put a like, write a comment, send a message. It's all very appreciated under Double Quote Dose Bliss. And it's just a fantastic thing that I'm so proud of and I love more than anything right now. So. The knots <laughs> at the Cineholic are fantastic. Mm -hmm. And yes, it's I vegan and it's photos. so good. You got your photos? I have three photos, yeah. Oh, cool. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm gonna put the tips on for you. So ladies and gentlemen, I just kind of do every other color, right? Just to make it pretty. Why she showing the pictures? Yes, yeah, so these are a photo of a dozen baby bun options. You can get one frosting on topping or you can get it in a catering tray with cookies and brownies and frosting in the middle. And then these are just one of the specialty roll options we have. And I brought this as well. Oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. Look uh, at the this cake. is what I made yesterday that you got to see. Yes. Yeah, so you can choose up to five options. We stick the rolls together and flip them over so it's flat on top. So everyone gets them for birthdays or special occasions. And it's a whole experience. So how did you get into the food industry, Shara? Um, honestly, I've had um, a couple positions doing that. I just, I love baking and the process of it. I find it relaxing, enjoyable, and I just love it. So what? I bake at home. That's probably how I started. I used to make a cake for everyone's birthday. Yeah. Um, like in high school, did it all for free. <laughs> like every other week I would make a cake. <laughs> so that's how it started. Okay, so guess what? So as I finish the finishing touches with these, I have to find my green chips here. I'm really funny about doing the color thing. Um, okay, so let me show you the one that's actually done that I did earlier, okay? Now, this one, uh, just, because of, just because of time constraints normally. Now, I want you to see, think of the beach, think of, think of how, think of this gorgeous drink that we have here. Look here, I want you to, look here. Look how pretty that is. Look at, look at this. I'm gonna put this on the tray. And just because Double D is gonna get to take this home, I'm gonna have him hold it up because this, I love the vinegar. This is a natural organic uh, additive ingredient for a cocktail and who would think? But the key, are the ingredients and everything we put in food and also life. So I just want you to remember, keep perfecting your life recipe every day. Don't forget Feed the Hungry and don't forget Barnes and Noble. And thank you to the mixologist, Double D of Las Vegas. And thank you, Shara Saunders.
amazing blogger, a lovely baker, and we love you all. And thank you for my birthday. Thank you. Take care, everybody. We'll see you next week.